I'm Phil Guyman. I was a pro cyclist for 10 years. Now I'm retired, but I still train as hard as I can to set the best times on the toughest climbs I can find and go on fun adventures on my bike all over the world. This is Worst Retirement Ever. So all year, my goal was to break the Everesting world record again. I had it before for like four days. So I knew pretty quick that having the right hill was critical. And so I was asking all year, I was asking you guys to find me segments of what's super steep and, and straight up and down. So there's no turns on the downhill, no mailboxes, no traffic. Now I looked at thousands of segments over the year and, uh, and nothing quite worked. And the ones that did work, there were some good ones in Ireland. Uh, there was one in Virginia that, uh, that has the current record. Finally, one day I was riding around in Malibu and I, and I looked up and I remembered one called Trancus Canyon and I'd been there before. I'd ridden it once or twice and, uh, and I rode it once with, with my friend Stefano Barberi who, when he got the KOM, he just went over there and was like, oh, I want to try that one. And he went and smashed the KOM. I remembered it being steep, but I didn't know how steep or how long. I hadn't thought much about it. So I went and checked it out and it turned out it's not perfect, but it's, it's super close to what I was looking for for the Everesting record, and it's right in my backyard in Malibu. We're at Trancus Canyon. So right off of PCH, uh, you make a little right turn and go up into this little dead neighborhood. There's maybe, there's a park at the bottom. There's maybe 15, 20 houses on the whole street. And it is steep enough. See, the average is over 16%. The whole hill, I think it's like 440 feet. I had the guys at Integrated Informatics uh, analyze it. So the whole thing is like 440 feet. Uh, the problem is, it's not really 16%. It's like 20% for the first bit, and then there's a little flat stretch, and then it's 20% again. So it's, it's way too painful, and then not hard enough, and then way too painful. But, but the average works. And, and given how close it is, I think this is gonna happen my choice for the next Everest attempt. Now, I've already done a bunch of laps, reconning it, checking it out, getting used to it. Um, I'm gonna get my bike specially geeked out for how, how crazy, horribly steep it is. Uh, but today, just because I don't wanna go for an Everesting record on a climb that I don't have the KOM for, uh, I'm gonna see if I can go faster than my buddy Stefano like five years ago when he wasn't really trying. Now, his KOM was four minutes flat. Uh, what that means is it's gonna hurt, but uh, let's do it. Now I forgot my, my Sea Sucker GoPro car mount, uh, so we're to film this old school, which is my friend Jesse out of the moonroof and, uh, and Emily driving back there under Jesse's butt. <laughs>
Okay. Hi. Hey. You know what that grade is? Like 18 in a steep part. Yeah. It's horrible, huh? Yeah. Nice job. So that was horrible and it hurts a lot. But the good news is on the day, I only have to do it like 75 times. Um, but I can go a lot slower. So there's that. All right, from Malibu, I'm gonna go pass out and maybe throw up. 